you set your job names and then and it's all the uniquely pass it like here the you see the 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 default etc prometheus and prometheus eml file from the promise your config files this is the your default default docker container uh, configuration location files that's that's the this is the default one so that what you need just you pull the docker and run the docker with with your configuration with your settings where you which microservices or which web application you try to monitor or try to uh, configure with the prometheus and then application automatically start you can go simply go to the local host or where you install then 9090 and your application running you try to visualize but as i said i i will show you detail every part when i try ne with the next screencast detailed information how can you do how you inst how can pull it how can run it and how can visualize every matrix information with prometheus and then and grafana tools so in the grafana very simple this docker run is sort of load the grafana image from the, the docker hub and three three hundred three thousands and then grafana running and then you see the really beautiful grafana dashboard and then you can do you can visualize which matrix is you try to visualize the BA matrix says or health matrix says or all sort of information profile matrix says all sort of information you can visualize there's a hundreds of matrix information you can visualize and and and, and make a dashboard you need what in the customized dashboard that's that's but that's the things i will show you later later part of the my my screencast so <clears throat> that's i that's that's the mo most important one so now i what we did just like uh, from my very very fast screencast we 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 start uh, in the uh, in the microservice first the microservice application was a monolithic applications uh, based application and then we see the the really clear overview how how it works and we we already talk about the detailed informations how the you it's being boot based microservice application web application integrate with the micrometer and then after the you you and micrometer plus the spring boot actuator and then after that the, the necessary configuration of the prometheus and then after that the prometheus is integrated with the grafana for rich client tools so that means you actuator the end of the actuator micrometer prometheus and grafana that's all that works perfectly for properly and then uh, we set our dependency injections and we set our property application dot properties and then we we run the application check the all the end matrices that we need that we expect from the uh, by a postman or in the browser or depending which you have it in the and the, what we need it uh, these cases and after that all the po all the endpoint or matrix test case is finished and we we install we configure the, our prometheus fa configure the, our uh, configure our prometheus uh, files that we are looking for these files and then when the files is ready and then all the microservices is running then we configure the files and then visualize the uh, visualize the information uh, pull the docker uh, prometheus do image from the docker hub and run the prometheus docker docker image with the with our settings uh, uh, with our settings uh, with our configuration for me uh, prometheus eml files then when the prometheus eml files all the dashboard is properly coming properly running and see everything is the all metrics as you can be visualized and then after that when the prometheus test dash, dashboard is not nice enough for you or it's good no it's not good enough for for your customer then you you can integrate the prometheus uh, dashboard to the, the grafana dashboard for the richer richer ui or gui that's that's the idea to to make it and to do it these plans and and every step so if you follow the all the screen cards that i have it i believe you can get really really good idea what i mean how can you start and how can you implement the microservices or web application and integrate the the all the dependency and properties configuration with the spring boot actuator and then micrometer and then uh, prometheus and then grafana that's i that's i mean that's you can you can get it followed but i will that's i said i will continue uh, the 
the the prometheus part how can you start the prometheus and can how can you visualize the all matrices and then when the the prometheus visualization is done then how can you visualize the information into the into the grafana tools and then then i will i i hope i can finish it very quickly uh, but i don't know i have a we have a really time constraint to do that one but i promise i will do uh, in, 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 in 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 so on or in future just just write down your comments or your ideas your concept into the our channels and then uh, we will try our best to to uh, to 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 give you to feedbacks on that this is the platform you can share with us we can share with your knowledge and our knowledge i believe it's help help your your daily developments and that's also help our our developments and then we can work together and subscribe the channel write down comments share with friends colleagues and then so on today i say bye bye and goodbye see you later bye bye